Yo, bro, I really like this thumbnail, but can you make the colors pop? Like, use the color theory like Mr. Beast does. Now, you may have received these kind of messages multiple times, but what does color theory or making the colors pop in general really mean? Well, on the color wheel, there are two spectrums. For an instance, if you pick the yellow color on the color wheel, the blue is on the complete opposite. That means it would be the most contrasting color to the blues. That is basically the whole concept of making the colors pop, which is to make the colors contrast in such a way that the subject stands out the most prominently. Let's take a look at the color wheel. We have the yellows, the oranges, the reds, and then on the other side we have the greens, the blues, the purples. One really good example of how the color um, color theory or you know making the colors pop really works would be this Ryan Frahan thumbnail. Here we can see that the majority of the background is green as it has grass and green trees and you really see that it's 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 completely green with a very slight little bit of a blue in the sky and when you see Ryan in the forefront he is just standing there with a big smile but when you first look at this thumbnail the grass isn't really the first thing that you get your attention to it's Ryan and why is that so well in the majority of the greens a color that is completely contrasting is applied your eye automatically draws towards it which is why Ryan used a complete opposite now for an instance if Ryan had used a red puffer jacket if we would have seen it from a smaller screen the tension grabbing quality or the value of attention grabbing if that makes sense does not really exist as much as it did with the blue buffer jacket a similar example would be this mic thumbnail as you can see the majority of the background actually more than 50 percent of the thumbnail is blue with the sky if he would have used something like a color that is more close to blue like a bit of a green maybe a sea green or if you if he would have used some color like you can say purple or something like that it wouldn't have really popped out but he used the orange color to really stand out as it was on the extreme opposite of the whole color wheel spectrum that is how you really use the color theory in order to get the attention of the viewer and really make the color pop on the YouTube algorithm or the YouTube feed. Now you can also use colors to convey emotion. It's not always going to be that you're going to be using the most extremely, extremely contrasting colors. It's going to be more like using the contrasting colors, but at the same time using them in terms of giving off emotions. Well, how do you do that? That's going to be a topic for another video.